<laughs> Old ones? No? Hmm? No? Trying to kill me? What did you say about a demon cleansing threesome? Grand Master P, in fact. Gloria, I forbid you to speak to this this person. Photographer. <laughs> Madam, I'll have you know that I am quite a wimp. But that's a little unfair, Miss Picot. Young Webster needed some help, and it was my duty as a Christian to... to hit him with a bat. Or... Don't yell at me, old woman! Oh! <laughs> Good. They all have heart attacks. <laughs> Good day to you. Good day. But it was outside. Yeah. Please, you, what? Your upsets you. Would you mind if I borrowed your Bible? I hardly like to be without it. This well, I need it. Reminder of my great aunt, a most God-fearing woman. But I need missioning. There's no other Bibles in this town, is the thing. I mean, he's he's living out of a hotel room. Come on. Do you have the Cthulhu edition of the Bible? Hmm. Or even worse, the Hambleton edition? That's my favorite. Uh, 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 no, not the library. Yeah, let his body rot in there for a while. Yeah, it's fine. that's fine. Yeah. yeah, we don't even have to tell the sheriff or anything. Nah, it's, it's, it'll, it'll sort itself out. It's fine. I bet the sheriff's chasing gypsies. Oh, did you know that the sheriff? Seriously, same voice actor as the sheriff in Dark Sea Two. I heard about that. Yeah. <laughs> what the? Makes my head spin just thinking about it. That's very kind of you. I just received a magnificent... <laughs> I also have a pretty locket at one dollar. What do you think? What, what are you, fencing shit now? No, just the photo plates. Thank you. Mutton chops. Parker pinches his cheek. I mean, that one dollar locket. Mm. Hmm, silver... <laughs> I could go for a pretty locket, Parker thinks to himself. <laughs> mm -hmm. His laser eyes zoom in on it. I'll take everything! <laughs> take all my three dollars! Come back soon. <laughs> all of the above. Come back soon and you got another three bucks. <laughs> You'll make my day. Next scene, he's in debtor's prison with his locket <laughs> and brooch. <laughs> Hopefully he bought photo plates. Surrounded by broken plates. <laughs> he's had seven heart attacks in prison. <laughs> Oh my god, eyes in the stars! Ooh. How does anyone's reaction to that not anything more than just, oh, that's weird? Oh god, tell me we are gonna romance the Bible out of this old lady. Well, it is a pretty locket. Don't try buying my respect with worthless shiny baubles. Speaking of baubles, here's a. Hanging kind of low there, Miss, uh, whatever your name was. Miss... Miss Bible Carrier. <laughs> How kind of you, Mr. Parker. Wait, what? Almost like the one I lost last week. A brooch is shiny. Oh, yes, that one's fine. Although mine was thousands of dollars, and this one looks like a very, very cheap knockoff. Here is my Bible. Please take... Oh, wait, care. didn't it belong to a relative a minute ago? <laughs> I love my Bible. Oh, I'll lock it. <laughs> hey, judge not, God. Wait, Bible shown here. <laughs> it is a beautiful Bible. Now you're thinking with jewelries. Then the woman dis- wait, what? On second thought, I don't want to marry you. Why did we animate that? <laughs> Thank you so much. Now how about you take an exodus from this scene, Parker? All right, now it's a genesis of examining every number in the Bible. Yes. It's like the Da Vinci Code, only much slower. <laughs> that is your duty, Euronomy. To look for numbers. Page three, four, Wait, this Bible has three pages in it. <laughs> according to St. John. We just guessed that? And the number of the beast is 666. Well, you needed a Bible for that, Parker? I'm going to use that in my bar trivia next week. <laughs> hey, guess what I just learned, guys? Later. This is my break. 
What is he, a blackjack dealer? Where are we? Bank? Yeah, it must be a... Where they store the money is another thing, but... There's people smoking in the back, too, though. Ah, uh, the 20s. A few words with the mayor. Not oh, you're at City Hall? The mayor is not here at this time. Ah... Uh... I guess so, yeah. The mayor's the Indian guy. <laughs> yeah, wait in his office! In his office. I don't want to bother you, but the mayor suggested I enjoy the view of Ilsmuth from his office window. Ah, yes. No, he didn't. You must be the photographer. It's about the next edition of the Ilsmuth Town Hall Journal. You're really just gonna let this dude into the mayor's office? What a believable story. Hmm. If I didn't have this damn cloud bubble in my- talk bubble in my eye, I'd, I'd question it. Alright, let's- No, I'm the reporter. Well, I'll Don't blow your cover story, Parker. Anything. Reporters. They can't leave anyone alone. Yeah, I agree. And don't bother the mayor having an affair in his office. <laughs> Nosy reporters. <laughs> and don't pronounce the name of the woman he's having the affair with, but I hear it's Mrs. Cthulhu. <laughs> oh, this is his office? What the fuck? That painting's not even on the wall. <laughs> None of the paintings are. <laughs> That's a painting in front of Parker's us? Parker's got sharp reporting instincts. Exactly as I thought. <laughs> you thought that was a painting? <laughs> Parker, come on, man. Oh, well. You probably could have just guessed that in a Flash game. Uh, uh. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is exhausting. <laughs> oh, uh. oh, my heart. My Ugh. heart is just racing. I hope it's all right. He had six heart attacks in the sequence. I, I missed it. Why is the number three, four, five again? I don't care. <laughs> Diary. No, close it. Oh, nah. it's more of a cigar than a case. But the mayor. Why will... don't I unscrew this case? Wait, how did Parker just use his telepathy to close all that up? You know, the view from that window, I don't think it's going to be that great. A piece of paper. Oh, I get it. It's like a cigar tube. Uh... Right. Yeah. So, is this going to be upsetting when you don't have any pictures to take like you said you would? Like, no, don't just sit at his desk with the shit. Looks like I'm the mayor now. <laughs> what the fuck? My name's Jonas. What the? Jonas Hamilton. Are we watching a movie? Twenty-nine. I made my fortune the hard way at sea. We're sports center. Boston businessmen jealous of my fishery. My fishery? How is anyone jealous of fishery? That that guy's a really good fisherman. He he can wait like a pro. So is this like the mayor's suggestion box with people vlogging stuff to him? I only read the most accursed books. <laughs> he initiated me into the ancient practices. At last. Parker I seems kind of disinterested. <laughs> also, he has a completely different face and look from before. Well, there's that too. Wasn't he wearing a tie also? <laughs> Each day my knowledge... Being an envied fisherman wasn't enough. I had to practice the occult. Hey, you're totally in my shot. But the ancients wanted more. Much more. You look so happy with Narakamus. Parker, the TV's behind you. The TV painting. <laughs> All this was in a cigar tube? <laughs> was the bargain, you see. <laughs> I screamed out the invocations. And he came. Who? Uh, well... Hi! What? <laughs> would take all I cherished, but that was of no importance. The pitiless god Dagon wanted that you- Dagon it. Dagon. That was the price of my immortality. Kill your wife, live forever? I mean, what a scoop. Oh. Was that Dagon I saw real quick? Next. Wilbur and Curtis. 
The second of them betrayed oh. and me. But the first the one was crazy. Footsteps. That's right. And... Hmm? Oh, okay. So the guy in the hood's the crazy guy's brother. I get it. How is this being shown? He has my <laughs> I think Parker just has a vivid imagination. He can they beg at the stones? Only he Parker's head has a partial black outline on it. It's good. Water, earth and sky come together. Can find my burial place. I'm cosplaying as Doctor Doom. See, back then, instead of a green screen, it was a brown screen that kind of matches his hair. Mm. Our work was destroyed in 1834, all because of that accursed Boliskin. But gods are immortal. Okay, so the last time Haley's Comet passed, the guy who went crazy stopped it, I guess. Nobody can destroy the families without the statuettes which I guard. And the secret incantation. To see the mean statuettes that Jug had, or? And the prophecy will come true. Why would you put this all in a cigar case? Like, how long is this piece of paper? Now let's get this uploaded to YouTube. <laughs> Sorry, I, my son's taco's playing hell with my stomach. I love that Windows Movie Maker effect. The great ancients will reign. Is this thing on? You filming? In the abyss. I think the lens cap is on. The no? <laughs> no? You sure? It'll it'll work. Someone restart PowerPoint. <laughs> restart the projector. Did our go-to meeting disconnect? <laughs> Reboot the projector. Cthulhu from in Kai. Does Parker's eyes sneeze? Oh. Please. Well, why did you close the whole damn safe? I need to take this painting, which puts my imagination on screen with me. That's really cool. <laughs> Open that real quick. Fortunately, the mayor is never, ever here. So, we are set. Yeah. Ah, beautiful view out that window. I was there for like an hour. I took many great photographies. Did you, did you guys hear any voices? That's just the sound of cameras. <laughs> Bye. Okay. Well, uh, little... Bye. Well, no. All right, we did it. I'm sure he's okay. <laughs> and flag looks kind of melty, and so does that one. <laughs> it seems like in the exact same position. Yeah, almost a like. little bit. Is that Parker? Yeah, yeah, I can't tell. Let me check him out, huh? Hmm? Mm -hmm. Let's just show you my crazy eyes picture. You're on an errand for Mr. Hamilton. Be that, excuse me. That's he who may not be named. <laughs> Mr. Unpronounceable, as the townsfolk call him. Mr. Hamilton <laughs> them from Boston. Three dollars? Good thing I invested in coal coin. <laughs> Thank you. Good day. <laughs> is it? She's like the scat man of this, <laughs> this town, is the thing. Right. I was too busy being just completely... <laughs> Confused by this whole thing. What, what did that? <laughs> That's how I spent this whole recording, actually. Oh, all right. <laughs> Mr. Parker, I see you haven't really accomplished much. There's some bugs getting in my library, Mr. Parker. <laughs> it's like an hour later, and it's like, wait a minute, I think this town's evil. Like, yeah, you were told that like 15 minutes ago. Mr. Parker, stink lines are coming out of my body. Oh, yeah, make sure you avoid that guy at all costs. Let's just... So, let's go. now what? Uh, let's get into another fight here, I guess. <laughs> oh, the wishing well. Oh, you know, this that... wasn't here before. Right. <laughs> the evil wishing well of Cthulhu. <laughs> I better just, uh... What? Be disturbed here. What? Even though everyone can clearly see me when they walk by. Like the gecko. Yeah, but you're right, right in the open. Oh, <laughs> get Yeah, sure. I'll buy it. Whatever. Sure. Oh, hey, Parker. Hey, Mr. <laughs> Parker. How's it going? Hey, how are you? Oh, I forgot. I'm in disguise. Oh, I'll get the... Okay. Don't look at my face, don't look at my face, don't look at my face, Just don't look at my face. Just keep looking down. Just, yeah. Grump! We can go. 
Mr. Wilbur is there. <laughs> what? Go where? Does Parker have a lot more information I'm not privy to? Or Oh, good, a space shuttle on the tower. Oh, yeah. Did, could we see that from further in the town? Yeah, right. And if not, why? <laughs> yeah, it's a giant fucking lighthouse. Nobody. I think I'll take these ridiculous clothes off. I'm glad I disguised my text as well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then he's just naked for the rest of the adventure. These are authentic dialogue boxes. <laughs> Comes back in a clown suit. All right. No, there's a door right there. Parker, we knew it was you. Is he, is he going to use the parcel like Solid Snake, I hope? Or, wait, what? Whoa, that was perfect throw. <laughs> uh, yeah, you were better off not doing that. <laughs> was, isn't that a door right there? We can't animate a sprite climbing a ladder. Just go full screen. Why couldn't he go in the front? Who made this fucking lighthouse? Now I can see what time it is. Ugh. A small sundial with a metal point at the center. I have the feeling that the point serves some purpose. Well, well when like the sundial, sundial point yeah, does serve a very specific it's, purpose. It's yeah. how the whole fucking thing works. Yes. <sighs> what an idiot. Well, well. A mechanism which opens. Maybe this will tell me what the pointy thing on the sundial does. Parker, you are the most boring motherfucker alive. What? What? Could you tell us what that is? Wings? Shout out the comment, we'll give you those. Alright. Uh. I'm lost. What does this have to do with Cthulhu? Oh, I got lost long before you, man. <laughs> but candles are factor into it. Uh, okay. Some... Somehow. Alright, so we combine the candle with the wings, and then you cosplay as Icarus. Right. Oh, God, he's lighting the candle with the magnifying glass. No, oh, no, but it's a mini game. Look. Parker, the candle's over there, man. No, it does. <laughs> yeah, no, that's a beautiful looking magnifying glass. Then Ike comes in with a lighter and blows his mind. I noticed, too, the magnifying glass doesn't seem to magnify much of the candle. <laughs> this doesn't have much of a glass, really. No, it's yeah. just. I think the, I think the Narakamas or whatever his name is did that for us, just to be nice. Wait, why is that opening the door? Be why not use the wax from this candle to strengthen the wing? Is someone trying to... Is there, like, a monster in there? Hurry up, Parker! Is somebody trying to get out of a bathroom? Why does... Why does now, the wax... Let's just hope this thing works. Otherwise... What What thing? is the thing? Yeah. I'm... There's something I'm hoping that happens. What is that? <laughs> yes! What? <laughs> oh my god! What? Look where he landed! I was shaking with the wings, I'm like, no fucking way! Have no fear, Mr. Parker. You are. Uh... <laughs> oh, hey, Mr. Parker. <laughs> Good to see you. Thank you. Yeah, we figured you'd drop it. <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome! Oh my god. <laughs> How did we even fly? <laughs> or silly enough to act, rather. I was really impressed with your flight. Do you have many broken bones? <laughs> Those wings were really small when you first encountered them. How did any of this work? Thank you. Is this the only way to find the gypsy camp? I'm fine. I just can't move from this position. <laughs> you could just leave me here. The danger is great for you. At least I'm More than that? <laughs> and we heard the devilish chanting. Did you say devilish chanting and he has a heart attack? Or do you mean danger that I don't purposely get myself into unnecessarily? <laughs> Oh, I mean, who, who'd have thought there was a monster in the White House? I'm glad that happened. Reminds me of why I love adventure games. Mm-hmm. No, I'm sorry. 
Pepto. <laughs> Pepto. <laughs> Pepto. <laughs> You'll see, my medicine will cure people's stomach. My stomach feels great all the time. <laughs> I can't believe what I saw, Mr. Pepto. That was the gram on a sled of Shadow of the Comet. <laughs> I mean, it makes you completely forget about the dancing bear. <laughs> the bear is not even keeping the beat this time around. He knows he's finished. Is that a sheep slash dinosaur? If you think so. <laughs> it's got a Yoshi face. Sheep door. Veloci sheep door. Veloci Yoshi sheep door. Yeah. Right, right, right. Facing me, Mr. Parker. If you can. <laughs> if any of your bones are not crushed right now. <laughs> So, how could he only get here via the wings? <laughs> how did he even know about the wings? How could he did, only- Did he know he was trying to get here? Why did he have to go in disguise to get to the lighthouse? Who was pounding on the door? <laughs> Why is there a terrible Monty Python effect with that pterodactyl? It's... You know me. My name is Lord Alistair Bolliskin. But the Cthulhu. I hope not your exact footsteps. You must destroy the curse of Cthulhu. <laughs> he sounds like he's trying to throw his voice or do like a silly like thing. Oh, you have to destroy he's the trying to do the duck face that people do in selfies. <laughs> hey, I'm here again. There's my pet pterodactyl. Did you really fly like him? A temple stood beside the shore. Yeah! What, did the gremlins own that temple? <laughs> sacrifices in the name of the great ancients. Is, is he naked? He looks naked. I'm... He's probably naked. Right. The temple of Mowgli. But Spike is the bad guy. Hey, I'm on fire too. Yeah. Hey, well, you know. Okay. The walls amplified the chance of the blood craze, the depths. <laughs> Right now, Cthulhu's checking like 18 watches on his tentacles. The great yes, we heard you. <laughs> they have not forgotten the splendor they once knew. You oh, these fucking ancients. When the combat passes, then the world will once more be enslaved to these loathsome gods. Sounds good. <laughs> yeah, I'm down. Sure. Yeah, all right. All right, cool. Just, you know, get caught in that shadow of that comet and... Next. So... Turn the page of the fortune ball. They must not be... Take it all in, ladies. Yeah. This is me. I'm fucking ripped. Check it out. Hey. You want the old ones or you want me? Ignore the arm. Believe it or not, this is covering up everything. It's really long, is what I'm saying. <laughs> It has to be this long because it's a third leg. That's what I mean. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. Whoa. The look of a player playing Shadow of the Comet. <laughs> you must fight alone. Um, about that. He just saw Parker ride in on the wings. <laughs> so hopefully you're over your little heart condition. I'm surprised the wing situation didn't aggravate that. <laughs> toppled to the bottom of the ocean. Wait, I thoughtless fools. I'm lost. Is this Conan looking guy, Bolskin? I don't the Bolskin's the tubby dude narrating this to you. Right. So who is this guy now who's staking the heart of the ape vampire thing? Uh, the mayor? City. Only a stone circle remains. There, the surviving members of the cult meet for their hideous rituals. Not that hideous, I gotta say. They're only hideous because they're naked. Right. They just need to put on clothes. And then they'd, be they'd just be fine rituals. <laughs> hey, rituals are fine. <laughs> I love them, man. <laughs> See, he looks a little Bruce Campbell-ish. Hey, rituals, man. Yeah. <laughs> hey. hey, I love him. Necromonicon. Hey. Oh, that was coming from him? <laughs> and in his city oh man fire. where's my other 16 arms we're sure this is not just like a big hermit crab or something we're positive someone play with me 
or play. Look at look at how evil C Rylan Cthulhu is. Even fish are afraid of. My him. God. Fish are afraid of anything. Uh, yeah. Some may gaze upon the face of the gods and hope to keep his sanity. And hope to keep icky goo out of their eyes <laughs> and neck. That's exactly what it looks like. Also, watch out for slime. You have to go see the Jonas Brothers. <laughs> That's my reaction to having to see the Jonas Brothers, yeah. <laughs> Great. Yeah, I'm not picking up anything. <laughs> Thanks for nothing, then he flies away. <laughs> <laughs> what if he could fly anywhere now? There's fast travel unlocked in the game. <laughs> Remember, nothing is Believe in yourself! Believe Lady, after doing that, I can do fucking anything.